Now let's talk about some ways that you can edit your lens. There are, there are quite a few of these ways. Uh, let, me, um, let me show you a very simple one first of all. Uh, let's get a listing of the lens. I'm going to type SPE in the command window, which gives you the lens specifications. I suppose you want to change something. Here's one way that you can do it. Let's say um, I want to change thickness number one, which is 12 millimeters. Let's use the artificial intelligence program for this. We'll talk more about this in another chapter, but I want to show you this. We can say one thickness question mark. That's an AI sentence. It's 12. We can say one thickness equals 11. We just changed it. If we do another spec. We see now it's 11. So that's one way to edit your lens. Very quick and easy using artificial intelligence. Here's another way. We're going to use the worksheet. I'm going to type WS. I can also click on one of the buttons, but let's do this as quicker. Now, here we go. I'll move this up so you can see it. Okay. This is the worksheet. Uh, you can click on a, a lens surface and it shows you the input for that surface. I click on each of these surfaces. You can see what happens. So in surface 1, we have a thickness of 11 at the moment. I could change that to 10 and click update. Now it's thinner. Another nice way, I can just run the sliders here. Look at this. I click on the slider and drag it. I can change that thickness to anything I want. Let's go to surface 3. I can just click here to change surfaces. Update. And let's change that spacing as well. So those are easy ways to edit your lens. Now let's look at some more ways. I'm going to type LE into the command window, which opens a macro editor with the entire lens file formatted. And of course, you can change anything you want in the lens at that point. Now, the lens that you typed in originally was shorter because this has all the defaults filled in. Um, uh, and of course, you don't need to do all those when you're typing it. Now, I can change something here. Let's change thickness uh, number one to, uh, let's say, six and click run this. And now we go here, and now the thickness is too small. So let's go to the worksheet. This is the worksheet button. Surface one. And here's the worksheet. And well, let's make that thickness a little thicker now. So these are easy ways to edit your lens. There's also a spreadsheet, <clears throat> which I don't use too much, but it works. Let me show you. SPS with thickness number one. Let's make that an 8. There, I just changed that. Let's close that down. And we're not done yet. In addition to all those other ways of changing your lens, you can use a change file, CHG. And you can put anything you want in there in the same format as an RLE file. One thickness, let's say back to 11. Now this is not artificial intelligence, so you don't put the equal sign here. This is a command mode form. End. And now we can say one thickness, question mark, and it's 11 again.